I hope what I'm conveying with the collection is anybody who can shop at H&M being female can go in and find a piece to go with their wardrobe. I don't want it just to be girls that are kind of tomboyish or punky. I hope it's someone that's quite feminine as well that could pick up one of the denim jackets or the leather pieces and mix it with like a floral dress. You know, I hope it's something in there that would appeal to everyone. But it's definitely more of a edgy kind of collection. The clothes are very special about the style. So it's not like about one piece, but sometimes when you wear something, it's just about the jacket or it's just about the shoes when you take a photograph. But this whole shoot is about the whole outfit, the whole look. It's probably these pieces that we're really attached to. This is, um, it's, we call it our Swedish American flag. So it's our Swinglish flag. And we didn't actually use this in the film, but we did use it on a photo shoot with Rooney. Our Salander is a little bit more internal. She's not so showy. I didn't want her to look like she was in a band or that she was goth. She's more just like, uh, wears what she would consider classic pieces to her. She definitely has her key leather jackets. She has her combat boots that she wears all the time. But there's nothing flashy or overt like that's, that stands out about her except for her personality.